My name is Megan MacArthur. I'm the pilot. Hi, my name is Aki Hoshide, a mission specialist. My name is Thomas Pesquet, and I'm a mission specialist. My name is Shane Kimbrough, commander of NASA's SpaceX Crew 2 mission to the International Space Station. So Crew-2 mission is a, is a mission to the International Space Station. We're going to launch from Florida on a U.S.-developed spacecraft that's called Crew Dragon. And it's going to take us to the space station for six months of research, of experiments, scientific experiments, and then we'll come back to, to Earth. I love this capsule we're riding on. It was named Endeavour on the Demo-2 flight. It has special meaning for me. I flew on the space shuttle Endeavour, so I'm really excited to fly on another spacecraft called Endeavour. It's even more significant, I think, for Megan because she's gonna fly in the same seat that her husband Bob flew in on the same spacecraft. So that's pretty neat. It's amazing to think that I will be sitting in the same seat that, uh, that Bob was sitting in when he certified that vehicle uh, the very first time that it launched. I don't think I realized that um, when I found out that I was gonna be assigned to the Crew 2 mission. I didn't realize it was gonna be the same vehicle, but that certainly adds a little something special to the, to the mission. So comparing the Crew Dragon with the space shuttle training, obviously the vehicles have a lot of differences, even though their goal is the same, to get people into low Earth orbit. And so with the space shuttles built in the 1970s, really, um, we had a lot of switches, like panels and panels of switches. With Crew Dragon, of course, we don't have those panels and panels of switches. We have a very um, clean wall environment and some large touch screens where we can switch between monitoring different systems. We don't have the same interaction with the vehicle. We can't send as many commands to the Crew Dragon as we could to Space Shuttle, but we have a team of ground controllers that send a lot of those commands and are monitoring in a way that we couldn't do with Space Shuttles back in the day. So it's very interesting to compare the two vehicles and the style of training that's required for the two vehicles. So we're going to launch from Cape Canaveral, Florida. Uh, Falcon 9 rockets, Crew Dragon is our spacecraft on top. And it's going to launch us into a roughly 200 kilometers altitude orbit. And then we're going to catch up with the space station. We're going to do a rendezvous, which is going to fly around the space station in a line and then dock, uh, open the hatches, and then we'll be on board. And that's the main job of the Crew Dragon spacecraft, is to take us from the insertion orbit all the way to the space station. Uh, in safety. So once we're on board the International Space Station, there's a lot of things. Our uh, main task is uh, doing a lot of different uh, science, whether it's uh, biology, material science, fluid mechanics. We're just going to do a bunch of nice research and science um, that's going to benefit all of humanity or it's going to help us with future exploration. So that's exciting to be part of something that's that grand. Uh, we will have some spacewalks planned for our um, expedition while we're up there, so that'll be uh, some great days out there to go outside. So on this flight, we have uh, American, French, and Japanese astronauts on board. Uh, it's the first time that you have uh, three different uh, nationalities on this uh, Crew Dragon. This International Space Station itself is a, a big collaboration between uh, 15 countries. It is very important to do a lot of uh, international cooperation. You know, no individual person gets themselves into space, right? It's a huge effort that, that happens. But it's also true on this global level that we have these big dreams where we look out you know, to the horizon and this desire to explore the universe around us. And we're, we're always going to be more successful when we work together um, with our international partners to achieve these incredible dreams.